Hello everybody, so this is just an update of the inter internet, international internet platform that we are engaged in doing. And I'm going to present a little bit here the project, uh, what are the tasks in the project and how is the, the plan uh, progressing. Now, <coughs> This project that uh, uh, we have not yet uh, uh, put all the tasks into in, in, into the calendar, uh, but it's a project that will last approximately until the uh, May. The idea <coughs> is that we are ready to present uh, this website and that the website is fully functional and usable by all the different countries that want to join this project and all the different teachers around the world that want to join this project uh, and all the different organizations uh, by the end by May, mid May. The idea is that in our international May retreat that we have, we are holding from the 11th uh, to the 17th to the 18th of May, sorry, 11th to the 18th of May, uh, the web will be <coughs> ready to see. Although the different, uh, it is done in a way that we have milestone that can be seen and can be uh, used in fact from day one like for example the first milestone here is the 12th to the 14th of October which is the home page and these are all the activities related to this home page the we have not yet finished this phase so that you see where we are now uh, we still have to uh, do this, which is free actual website with course entries, entries until end of March plus May course, which means that the actual website that we have, uh, we have already prepared it and we are freezing it with uh, contents and designs that are then usable uh, to, uh, to the design of the new homepage. This means that uh, it would be good that we have conversations because if AMS, for example, is busy doing a web, you would be doing basically this. And if we coordinate, uh, then we will be able to include it without having to throw things away directly into our project. We are now in the phase of uh, meeting uh, with team to brainstorm and share with a selected group of teachers the user interface proposal of this website, which you know uh, you've seen in in different uh, in different. Uh, so this is a little bit the tree of the different menus uh, and you know each of these menus then have the international connections to the ashrams so it's a multi-site website with uh, uh, a learning management system uh, which uh, is uh, is something that will be very very good uh, for all teachers around the, the world uh, now, as you can see, uh, we have uh, uh, milestones selected, like for the one for the October, there's another one in November, uh, there's another one at the beginning of November, another one in November, another one in November, so in November we close quite a few milestones, and there's another one in December, uh, another one in December, we still have to work a little bit on the dates because we have some, you know, calendar prog problems with the team involved in this project. With the, the project is dealt by actually five uh, people plus me uh, that uh, uh, include uh, three engineers 
which are these three include uh, Christina, which is uh, uh, my daughter, which is doing the graphical designs and all the imaging and video production for the website. And Kiku, which, which is helping with uh, content, content uh, providing. Also, there are a lot of volunteer work in digitizing audios and videos and things like that that we may need. Also, obviously, we will be able uh, to use all the, um, the digitized material that societies might have straight away. So, as you can see, the, the, the website, uh, um, you know, includes, you know, everything that a website needs to include to uh, be in the first page results of Google when you look meditation or mindfulness in your area and all these things. Also, we have, you know, all the teachers will have within the website their own, you know, all the teachers that are actively teaching uh, will have within their website, uh, this is the learning management system uh, part of the tasks. These are for the ashrams, events, resources, free meditations, retreats, and then the different centers. We have meditation centers in different places of Spain, but you know, uh, different countries can organize their centers or their teachers uh, so that each teacher or center or area has their own um, kind of little website so that they can easily write articles, easily call for events, and so on and so forth. There will be a learning management system that will have the ability, you know, to do video conferencing, all integrated in the website, payment of courses, searching for courses, etc., etc. There will be the the home for the senior teachers, which are which is the home of the teachers that will be able to access to information, to all the information, and create, you know, material. Uh, that is then published in the web so that teachers can use that material to create their material for the students of these teachers. So this is where we are up to with the website now. We still have not finished the project plan, plan phase. Uh, we still have, you know, to define the certain database requirements. The, the tasks that have been finished are, are in kind of gray mode. So all these tasks are the tasks that have, al they have already been finished. And these are the tasks that we are engaged now. One of them is completing this project plan, which is uh, scheduled to be completely completed the 25th but that it will be probably delayed until the beginning of September because I am starting today a course and will not be able to give all the necessary inputs to the other people to finish it. But anyhow, we will try to finish it if, if it is not the 25 as soon as possible so we don't accumulate many delays, although this is going on on date and this connects with the design of main structure of the website. Uh, so um, uh, it's uh, perfectly, it will not affect other tasks. So we are basically, we can say that we are on time for the moment with the project and we will see the first results as the home page with the milestone acceptance of the home page around the mid mid october so this is where we are up to today with this project as you can see it has uh, lots of tasks lots of uh, software development lots of content preparation uh, and it's a complex sophisticated website but the most important thing is that it will be uh, the mechanism by which students will come to teachers 
and we will be able to make good the 20,000 US dollars that we have to spend every month between AMS and, and the Spanish Meditation Society in, in ads, uh, the ads so that you can see what this means, means that for example, we you are not using it now, but we are, so um, uh, let me see, uh, initiate session, uh, and this is my account in the Spanish Meditation Society uh, Google domain, and so you know I have here the ads we are running. So this is the total uh, summary of the ads. We have uh, shown the ad to 20,000. This is of the last week. We have shown the ad to 20,000 people. Uh, we have received 978 visits to our website and we have spent last week 1,198.09 us dollars and then you know we have different ads for different this is an ad that we just started which is yoga yoga in seville yoga classes in seville and one of our teachers teaches meditation and yoga so we provide this service to teachers so that if they do yoga well we put it so this is uh, the 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 ads that we are doing for schools and so on and so forth and this is the ads we are doing for one of our ashrams and there is the ads we are doing for uh, uh -huh. this is the ads that we are doing for the other ashram i don't know where it is here uh, no ah uh, well ashram ah uh, here ashram lateral so this is the other ashram we have and the ads we are running for the other ashram so this this money that we spend but uh, uh, we don't spend because it's a grant for from google that ams also has at the end with a good properly working website with the proper seo and with all this online uh, teaching uh, system that we are integrated integrating what we'll bring is um lots of uh, students to the teachers and so the society will be able the societies will be able to produce its work so i think it is important that we we speak uh, because it would be nice that whatever you are doing uh, in your website is done in a way that is reusable by this system so that the work is not lost and it can be easily integrated in what we are doing it will probably just need a little bit of video conferencing between my engineers some whomever your engineers are doing this uh, all the team is bilingual so there will be no problems in speaking here as you will see in the list of tasks uh, we have uh, um, already i'm uh, you know i'm going to do this but we have uh, a lot of tasks that are not yet assigned or given a time to do them at all which is the translation it would be good that you know i got some help from uh, people uh, that can speak Spanish and can translate to English, uh, being English the native language, because it's easier, like for me, it's easier to translate from English to Spanish and not the other way around. And in any case, <coughs> whatever I translate, I would need someone uh, that uh, will help with the editing of these translations, which includes doing your own version of the texts that are going to be there in for example the home page of the american meditation society because this will be a general design with a home of a home page with the different sections so these are things that 
if we share them now, we can do them in, 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 in coordinatedly and this will mean that we will do it to the like of everyone and uh, usable uh, for, by everyone. So anyhow, this is uh, about it. Uh, I am once the project plan is finished, I am going to um, hire a service that within this application that allows me to have guests uh, that can, uh, you know, make a follow up of the project. So you will be able to follow up the project task by task every time, you know, you go to a certain task well you have you know the description of the tasks all the different uh, the activities that have been done in the tasks and documents related to the task uh, so you will be able to follow this uh, very nicely you will be able to follow also the timing of each of the tasks because you have all this and the the relationships of all the tasks this is a simple to use application for anyone that is good with computers or has some experience in project management and uh, anyhow this is it i'm waiting for your news uh, goodbye namaste